Welcome to the Spinify Professional training video. In this section, you will learn how to control the view of your model to obtain the best position for the work you are performing. With the model open, you can left click on the mouse and rotate the object around. And notice how it rotates on the center point of the screen. You can change the default setting of how it rotates at the bottom of the Spinify window toggling between Pan, Zoom, and Rotate. You can also fit all the parts into the window by right-clicking and selecting Zoom Fit. You can zoom to a point on the model by selecting Focus Point. Select any point displayed on your screen and now the model will center and fill the window. You can also right-click and select Look and go between Surface Normal, PMI Annotation, and Annotation Plane. Right-clicking and selecting on Focus Part will then center and zoom so it fills the screen and when rotating it will go around a center point. Right-clicking will also allow you to go between panning, zooming, and rotating the model. You can also select all of these features quickly from the Zoom Fit icon. In Spinify Professional, there are predefined views that will allow you to easily look at your model from different perspectives. This can be beneficial so that the views will be split and you can have multiple perspectives at the same time. From the Viewports icon, you can choose how many viewports you'd like. Notice how each can be manipulated independently from each other. By selecting the perspective view icon, this will display the model as seen from the human eye to the standard isometric view. By selecting the Views pane, you can go between the standard views. You can also create user-defined views that will be saved to the .3D file. To create a new view, key in a name. Note that if you check the Make This the New Startup view, Next time this .3D file is opened, it will be oriented in this view position. You can move around the file, rotate, and when you select your saved view, it will restore 